Is your digital presence lacking responsive web design? If your business or organization has any kind of a digital presence, you'll want to stick around and learn all about responsive web design. Due to a big uptick in smartphone and tablet usage, website traffic can come from a variety of sources other than desktop computers. Researchers predict that the upswing in smartphone usage will only continue. This is why implementing responsive web design in your business is so crucial. I'm Noel with Jotform, and in today's video, we'll discuss what exactly responsive web design is, its purpose, and how it works. Let's go. Back in the day, web designers would create two separate websites for a company, one for desktop users and another for mobile device users. However, now that smartphone usage is higher than ever, web designers can create just one website that seamlessly scales content and elements to fit any screen. This is responsive web design. Implementing responsive web design into your website means each user, despite their device, will have a flexible experience. Layouts and presentation might adjust according to the size of your screen, but your website and the information on it will remain the same. The creator of responsive web design is Ethan Marcotte. Ethan found that his clients would often come back and ask him to design a website for the iPhone after completing web design for their desktop websites. This led him to the idea of creating a single, scalable design so that his websites and their functions would be coherent between mobile devices and desktops alike. Not only does a responsive web design approach make it easier for the user, but it also optimizes costs, saving web designers time, and ultimately creates better results for the bottom line. A win, win, win. Now that we have a better idea of what a responsive web design can do, let's look at its overall purpose. Whether your business deals in e-commerce, design, technology, publishing, or education, a responsive design can benefit you. Having just one website that anyone can access means you'll be able to reach more people and more devices than ever. Think of responsive web design as a provider of the one-stop shop experience. A user could view a newsletter on their desktop at home, then subscribe to it later while they're on their laptop at work, and then send the link to friends via their smartphones while lounging on the couch. The main purpose of responsive web design is so that users don't have to pinch or zoom or take any extra steps to see your website's content. Their experience will be uniform across all devices without any distortion. A positive user experience on your site is key to keeping them coming back for more or purchasing products. One major benefit you have is lower maintenance costs. You'll also have an easier time pulling analytic reports with just one website. Also, Google's mobile-first indexing promotes responsive web design by ranking mobile friendliness. The Google bots index a website's mobile version first, which is a significant factor driving responsive development. All right, now that you know just how responsive web design will boost your business, let's dive into how it works. Essentially, responsive web design allows websites to shape content and images for both small and large devices. It does this by using flexible grids, flexible images, and media queries. By syncing your layouts, graphics, and images to each user's device, the website's liquid layout scales to fit the screen accessing it. Here's the technical breakdown. Responsive Design's CSS3 media queries instruct the website to collect data for the site's visitor, and then it tells that information to the website software so it knows which design to respond with. Pretty cool, huh? Then the user's browser will respond with the flexible image that best suits the user's screen size. Although users gain the same information from the website regardless of device type, the website itself might look a little different on a desktop versus a smartphone. Again, all the same info is there, but it might be slightly different due to the device-specific layout. Tons of businesses and organizations have found a responsive web design to be helpful. In fact, back in 2002, Audi.com was the first to use a responsive website, and they haven't looked back. They realized that fixed-sized web pages just weren't good practice. Higher education institutions are also finding responsive web design to be a no-brainer. 
they realized that their first impression on students would likely be via their smartphones. Essentially, companies across all industries have found responsive web designs provide a more seamless experience for users. Responsive designs will also set your company up for future success as mobile devices continue to be a prominent part of our society. Let's review. Responsive web design is the way to take your company or organization's website into the future. With its liquid layouts, any user can access the same website and gain the same user experience, regardless of the device they're using. No matter your industry, you could benefit from a responsive web design by lowering overall costs and ultimately making your user experiences as seamless as possible. Well, thanks for tuning in. I'm Noel with JotForm. See you next time.